Hello, I'm Chucky, and I'll be your favorite dingus. So hot. Oh, this. All right, there we go. I'm Chucky, and I'll be your Tuesday. The topic for this week is questions, and Vicky asked me what the most inspirational piece of music was to me. And though not a single type or song that has changed my life, but an album that really influenced me as a younger kid was the Digimon soundtrack. This soundtrack had the Money Money Boss tones, Less Than Jake, and Bare Naked Ladies, and it just really introduced me to real music other than like my Pokemon soundtrack or Britney Spears or Aaron Carter, and it just introduced me to some better, more quality music that would influence me for years to come. Besides just the Digimon soundtrack, a song, um, Simple Pleasures by Bizonite, which was a cover of the original Simple Pleasures by Henry Homesweet, was my introduction to chiptune music and was really crucial into where I am today because that song introduced me to the community, 8bc.org, and really got me interested into chiptune, which I make today. And another two musicians and sort of bands that have really influenced me recently are Lady Lamb the Beekeeper and The Lighthouse and the Whaler. Lady Lamb the Beekeeper is a solid musician who uses really powerful lyrics and is just completely raw. Most of her stuff isn't polished and clean sounding and I can really appreciate that and how much time she puts towards each of her songs, usually ranging from four to seven minutes each. And Lighthouse and the Whaler is composed of a few friends of mine, although they're older and all graduated. They're friends of my friends and old classmates of friends and just their music is just kind of gives me hope on being an actual musician and performing. And their song Venice is one of my most favorite songs and just each time I hear I hear a new and different sound and that's really crucial to who I am today and the type of critic and musician I am today. I go into each song less close-minded and I'm not judgmental of every single song and just hate an entire musician or an entire song. I listen to a song for what it's made, the target audience, and how they made it, and it's really helping me open my mind up to the musical world. My question for Jamie is, what is the worst experience you have ever had on a vacation or trip away from home? I'm Chucky and I'm signing off.